Hi guys and girls and welcome back to another video. In this video we're going to be modeling a low poly fence for our FPS game in Unity. You can check out the last episode where we created a fountain. And also if you're new you can follow the hotkeys down here. So first I will create a new cube by just pressing shift A and uh, going mesh cube. Now using my numpad I will use 1 and 5 to go into front orthographic view. And then I'll press shift tab to enable snap during transform. And as always, I'm just going to move it so it's flat on the ground here. And this is our first kind of a pillar, I guess, of the fence. I want to scale this on the X and the Y axis. So I'll just press S, Shift, Z. And now I can just do this. I maybe want to go a bit thinner. Something like this. That seems fine. And now what I want to do is I will go into edit mode with tab. And then select everything with A. Press Shift D and move this on the X axis. So just press X and move it here. So two grids apart. And then press Shift D again to duplicate X to move the, on the X axis and move it on the other side. So we have this kind of starting point. Now what I want to do is duplicate this again, but now I'll place it in the middle right here and then press R y 90 to rotate it for 90 degrees and then i will press s shift x to scale it a bit more like this move it up and then press s and x to scale it on the x-axis shift d to duplicate and move it down you can have three of them you can have four of them you can have as many as you like i think three looks good like this and this is basically our fence now what we can do is just uh, in Unity, uh, duplicate this, place it here, and it will make it look like it's all one fence, but it's not. Of course, last thing, we have to add a material, and I will just call this Mat1, and change uh, the name here to Fence. And of course, uh, since we're importing this into Unity, I will select it, press Rx minus 90, and then press Ctrl A, apply location, rotation, and scale. And then you can press RX90 again. Now I'll just save this as a fence. And also file export FBX, export as FBX, click selected objects down here, and the scale here. Export. That's it for this video. If you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like, comment down below. You can leave suggest suggestions for future videos. You can subscribe if you want and you can also go follow me on my social media and my Patreon if you're that kind. There's links to that in the description and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye bye.